What is up, YouTube? It is Hollywood Floss, the worst producer of all time. Back with another, back, back with another video. In today's video, we're checking out Lo-Fi Panda 3. All right, we're gonna check out just some of the sounds. Might cook up a little loop or something. We're just gonna have some fun. A sampled instrument powered by three engines, featuring texturized presets inspired by Lo-Fi, Soul, Boom Bap, Chill Out, Nostalgia Cinema and hip hop music, all right? But before we go any further, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you get any video I upload to the channel. Now we're just checking out the factory today and then I'll do separate videos for the expansion, all right? Let's go into FL Studio and check it out. Okay, so we're in FL Studio and of course I got my MIDI with me. I just gotta get the tempo right. So the first one's at 100. So we'll just come in here and check out some of these sounds. All right, so you go to factory and then you go over to this folder right here and it will pop open some of the sounds. All right, so let's go here. All right, factory and then brass. Oh, I'm sorry, bass. So 90s guitar bass. So, so far. Girl, you gotta hold it down to get that little crackle. I won't go through all of them. Alright? It's because you want to be surprised when you get stuff. Yeah. And of course you can use these electronic bass for um, your Travis Scott type of sound. Let me get a couple more. Use these for hip hop too, you know. Oh, just a lot of E bass. All right, and then upright. The Dilla Double. One of the best use of um, upright bass is in the intro track to Common's uh, album B. Do, 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 like, do, 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 do. that's one of my favorite intros, all right, all right, brass, let's get into some of these melodies, we had 100, and we had lo-fi, so it was all about lo-fi, all right. hey, hey, only did two brass but these brass are kind of fire like hold on now this might be the go-to yeah <laughs> they got something with the brass it's hard to do the brass you know it don't sound right most of the time All right, so that one's just programmed lower than the other ones. Hold on, man. Hold on. I'm telling you, this, these brass is spectacular. Okay, I don't want to spoil too much. We're just going through a couple of them, but hey, we feeling it. Okay, so how are we going to do this drum one? Where is it at? It's too high? Oh, there it go. Okay, only the black keys it looked like. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, so I'm press A, delete. Oh, it's a loop too. Okay, I got you. I'm, hey, I'm, I'm, I'll see when I do these reaction videos. I'm not like these other guys. I really be reacting to it on the fly. All right, I'll be faking it. It's about oh, I'm so, no, I'll be really, I'll be really on the fly. I like it like that. It's better. And then we can always go back and make another one.
a little fast, but hey, you get the, you get it. First drum kit sounds, just checking it out. Would you buy or deny this so far? So far, would you buy or deny? So I'm making a lot of fast beats. Okay, okay. So we got a little something, something in the drum kits. We'll check out some Foley. All right, so some nice like father had to just, you know, check it out. Check it out. My bad, y'all. My bad. Let me get back into it. Electric pianos. All right, let's go to a basic one. Let's turn this up to 105. And then let's get in a new, some new news. <laughs> one right there. Okay, electric piano's coming with it. I'll be on. Keys. Let's go to 110 this time. And I'm like I said, this is a quick overview. I will be making more beats with this. This is, yeah. <laughs> some sounds we can work with y'all that's all you can ask for when you buy these things you're like man please let me get some sounds it's been hyped up Like they could have, they could have easily put electric pianos, keys, pianos in the same thing, but they didn't. So that must have been like they like we going for it. 
I like it. I, you know, hey, be ambitious. Oh, I like that one with the bookstore. Coffee shop. All right, I'm going. I already selected. Yeah. Pitch percussion. Okay. Ooh, that one crystal clear. It could definitely be a trap beat right there. Plucked. 8 bit. That's a that's a that's a beat right there, man. Like, I hate when I be doing these videos and I get a beat because I ain't gonna remember that later. I like that one too. Afro beat right there. I'm going to mess with that one. Let me just change up just to see how we react to some soulful trap melodies or something with these sounds. Restored Panda. Like I said, I ain't gonna do all of them. We'll be here all night. Okay. Okay. Sims and Woodwinds. All right, we got a couple more. I'm not gonna lie, man. This is a strong VST. What y'all think? Leave your comments below. What do you think about this VST? It's a strong one, y'all. Trying to find some more melodies for y'all. <laughs> That's just the clarinet. That's just the clarinet. I wonder did Andre 3000 use the flutes from Lo-Fi Panda. It's your boy Hollywood Floss, the worst producer of all time. Hit the like and subscribe button. I didn't even mess with none of this. I just wanted to give first reactions with the factory. Uh, preset bank and then we'll go in we'll make some loops with uh, some other time in another video but yeah what do you think i like it man i've been holding off on this one for a while finally got around to it just you know life be life and but hit the like and subscribe button what do you think leave the comments below lo-fi panda three all right until next time peace